Hello, my name is Laura Unger, a reporter at Kaiser Health News. Today we're going to talk about hunger in America and how seniors aren't getting enough to eat. Here are five things you need to know. One, 5.5 million seniors aren't getting enough to eat. That's nearly 8% of Americans 60 and older. It's more than doubled since 2001 and it's only expected to grow. And it's even higher for African Americans, Latinos, and poor seniors. And it's a largely hidden problem. Two, Government relief has lagged far behind senior population growth and inflation. The Older Americans Act helps provide food for hungry seniors. The act pays for home-delivered meals and meals at senior centers. But government relief is falling short, and private donations can be hard to come by as well. In fact, the entire safety net designed to help hungry seniors is fraying. Three, malnutrition can make people sicker and prevent healing. Seniors without steady, nutritious meals can wind up in the hospital, driving up costs for Medicare and Medicaid. Seniors can end up back in the hospital even after they get out if they're not getting enough healthy food. And hunger can even kill. In one case in Cincinnati, a man starved to death in his freezing apartment. He weighed just over 100 pounds. Four, the Older Americans Act expires September 30th. Now Congress must decide what to do going forward. In June, the House voted to raise funding to $1 billion for next year. But when you look at inflation, that's still less than a decade ago. The Senate still needs to weigh in. It's unclear how much Congress will spend moving forward. Five, many seniors are left waiting for Meals on Wheels. Across the nation, it's tens of thousands. Some are waiting more than a year. And this is happening in your community. It could be your mother, your father, your grandparents, your neighbors.